Today is day one out here for Chris, the giveaway winner. You want to introduce yourself and tell us where you're from? Uh, I'm Chris. I'm from Pembroke, Ontario. Uh, flew in late yesterday and uh, super excited to be here. So what kind of backcountry sledding experience do you have? Uh, so for the most part, we go in northern Quebec in the Chick Chocs and uh, another place called Destination mont -Valin, And uh, we try and get out there at least uh, three or four times in the season. And how many years have you been riding? Uh, I've been riding seasonal since 2016. All right, you'll see some, some big mountains today. It's looking like a beautiful day. We're gonna have it with a good crew. Uh, first things first though, we're gonna go over some safety stuff and teach Chris about the Avi transceiver, how to use it and all of that stuff. Okay, for, first test, there's someone buried in an Avi. Whip it out. Found it. What's going on today? How you feel, Chris? Pumped, man. Super Pumped. excited. Hell yeah. Ready to sweat it out. <laughs> and his insulated suit. But he, he's going to space today. All right. Today, we are back on the G5 154 Turbo. It's been a long time. And we got Chris out with us, the giveaway winner for the Freerider experience. He is riding my 9R. He was interested in riding a boost, but the only boost available from full speed was a 165 Pro, so he said he'd rather ride the 155 9R. He's thinking about a boost for his next snowmobile. But uh, we don't have the deepest snow for him today, but what we do have is absolutely amazing weather, and we're gonna show him some pretty cool stuff up here today, taking him into the big mountains. And in my opinion, having this kind of weather in terrain for your first time in the mountains beats having that deep snow. Deep snow is fun and all, but it's not too many days in a year where you get to do this type of stuff. And he's gonna have two absolutely perfect days by looking at the forecast. What do you think so far? Yeah, when we get to the first kind of hill, yeah. we'll just stop at the bottom and I'll just talk about it with you for a minute. So, this is the hard hill. Like if you're unsure, I'll just ride it up. It's like, right. no pressure. And I know you'd rather me not have right. No, I don't care. Kind of yeah. I don't want to get stuck up like that. Well, it's not that. The snowmobile is going to come back down. Yeah. You, like, there's no stopping on that hill. It's like Jackson Hole already! Yeah, right there. <laughs> <laughs> nice work getting her stocked! Nice! Good first stock of the day! Wow, that's a nice line. <laughs> it didn't take long for Chris to say, oh, it doesn't look that steep in the videos. Everyone's famous line. We're going gloveless today. I really should have got some moto style gloves, but uh, yeah. I like that big square rock in the background. Yeah, that's really cool. Man, this place is cool. Never get tired of it. So vast. Let's go see what Landon's doing. Oh, they're doing some jumping. Oh, 
little jumps. Not that little. <laughs> okay, we better at least hit it once or twice. Ah, need to go very big. To the bottom. Jacob. <laughs> yeah, boys. Ah. It run is terrible now. I know, it's brutal. Sled oh man. It's doing the same bogging problem now as what it did when I gave it to the dealer. Oh, that's really annoying. That's dumb. I can't even do anything! I thought you were going to land on my helmet. <laughs> Everyone's trying to get the park job. That's why it's a truck job, Josh! Mine kind of sucks, but it's there. First thoughts? Can't believe it. <laughs> you can finally be out here. A little different than Quebec. Definitely different from Quebec. <laughs> How are you stuck? A broken sled, baby. Oh, blame the sled. Do you, you don't want a ski pole, do you? I would like one, What's going on? Did you pull a Jerry there? <laughs> His buddy's told me to call on the Jerry. Landon's doing some uh, stuck lessons here. Stand on that side. Yep. Grab this with one hand. Yep. And I'll just lift up the ski and give it gas. <laughs> Cuts the track out so that you can gotcha. start yanking on it. <laughs> Kickflip! Oh! Do it again! Double roost him! <laughs> I thought it was gonna knock you over. For sure. <laughs> Build it! <laughs> oh. Oh. 
What are we doing? Just drive right into him. <laughs> drive right into him, push him over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! They kind of buried me here. <laughs> they can't find shit to hold. You should have put it in the tunnel bag and you could have just had a Got this little black licorice thing go. from Landon? Yeah. I don't know, these guys are all watching me like I'm gonna die eating this thing. It's not good. If you like it, you're weird. <laughs> that does not go well with the cookie. It doesn't really go with the cookie. I don't mind it though. <laughs> it's so gross. It was so Chris? salty. Oh, tough go. Tough go. <laughs> you want another one? No, thank you. If you. And you like them? Yeah. So, uh, can we see what's wrong here? Yeah. Do we think uh, do we think the dealer didn't didn't tighten that properly? Because it only took about 15 kilometers to fall off. The one nut's tight, but that nut there is gone, as you can see. It's probably down here somewhere. Do you want to pick it up and we'll see if we can get it to the front? <laughs> <laughs> so give us the, the bad news. Um, the bad news is there's no good news. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> oh, we should start it up. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> oh, With his head in there. <laughs> no. Stick your head right onto the intake so you can't start it. I can't see it. You can try too, but there's nothing in there, bud. Don't Sorry. don't tell me that. I told you the bad news is there's no good news. There's no good news. Okay, I don't think I took a clip of it, but we got a makeshift nut put on there. It doesn't really push the ray valve back in properly, but it pulls it out, so we got full throttle. Okay, now that this thing's fixed, we'll go uh, see what Chris wants to do. The guys have been great. They've been trying to give him some pointers with uh, everything, really. Pop overs to little jumps, everything in between that. Looks like Landon's going to get upside down here. Look like you're just about ready. Just about. That sun is hot today. We got packing snow right to the top of the Alpine here. At least we got nice weather. Again. Want to try this? No. Not Just take it for a spin. No, not at all. Why? I'll put it in somewhere. I don't want to do it. Well, you can't screw up just going up there. You sure you don't want to try the turbo life? Sure. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure, bro. Come on, get on here. <laughs> just drive it up to the top. It's a very different machine than, than this. He pull starts and I go to go shot start. Oh, it looks like a natural. actually feeling pretty strong today. You can keep ripping it if you want. It's so different. The power is pretty fun, eh? Yeah, it feels way more. Have you been on a turbo before? Okay. No. Not even turbo trail slide. Ah, just keep ripping it for a bit then. This is probably like a beginner mountain rider's dream right here. Just having fresh alpine with no tracks. Well, <laughs> there was no tracks. Yeah, so what you do here and just go wham and it'll just come right down kinda if you wanna try it. 
So, if you just keep pulling it around down the hill, you don't even have to roll it. <laughs> yeah, kind of exactly like that, and then you just keep bringing the front end around. <laughs> no, you got her. Your, your one ski's kind of gonna dig in there. Just kind of throttle and turn down the hill at the same time. <laughs> yeah, that ski's really in there. <laughs> Somewhere over here built for Mary Ellen Chris and whoever else wants to hit it. We're oh, right here. It's a beautiful little popper. Pretty sure Chris wants to hit this. Talk Swedish again there, Lando. <laughs> <laughs> he just called his mother a whore. <laughs> Guys, I think you need one more cameraman on there. Can I come? <laughs> it's great! We were going fast, I'm scared. <laughs> I was like, Coming up was way better than going down. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, she's doing it. Oh, she's nice. Chris, 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 Chris. And it's gonna have Chris throwing 270s by the end of tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nice. Yep. Nice work, dude. That was perfect. That was all right. Nice second job, one felt man. way better. Yeah, no, it's good. You landed like perfectly. Yeah. yeah, the second one. Yeah, I, I know you want to do it again. Yeah, yeah, no, <laughs> yeah. definitely. Oh, oh. Do really? Yeah. The amount of joy that that sled has brought people this year <laughs> makes me so happy. 146 Turbo Life. Yeah, buddy. We got one coming next year. How was your uh, little little air wheelie? Fantastic, man. <laughs> grabbed a little much and then didn't grab any back brakes. Hi, ah, that's all part of, part of learning to jump the sled. Yep. They added more lip to the jump. Now I think they're gonna send it all the way to the basement, Landon and whoever else. We just witnessed the gnarliest shit. Landon just jumped this and his chain exploded midair. The sled nosedived and he bailed off the side and we couldn't see him. We just run and he's good. Oh Dude, that was God. terrifying. That was terrifying. Hey, chunk of chain case. <laughs> I gotta stop sliding soon, man. Dude, that makes you scared to... Like, if that wasn't landing... Yeah. <laughs> I, I would have been squished. Yeah. Hopefully somebody got that on video. How did it... It changes like a... Yeah, oh my it... god. That was... Oh, we jumped in front of That's close. Oh. It changes like a... Yeah, oh my good. god! That was. Oh, the running boards just pushed me up. Like cover. it felt like I got like catapulted up. <laughs> and then I just landed in a pencil dive and then I looked. The slide was rolling straight towards me, so I rolled out of the way and then it rolled by me. And then you guys are all running like maniacs. <laughs> <laughs> like, 
Yeah, it was actually pretty smooth. Did you miss that? It did. It looks so smooth. Hold it, the peak. <laughs> That's gonna make a good uh, oh, yeah. video. Right? That wasn't even is there any other broken lengths or is it just right here? So I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be a high vo. Yeah, yeah, it's not a high vo. No. I'm really sad because I. Yep, somebody has to do the 270 jump now. Oh, no, you can use my snowmobile. No, Matt's like, I this just want it to be you a new video. We're looking to really start. Well, Roddy was around for a little bit, then I was dead. Yeah. What? That's not a bad pull. No! We should be able to pull it up high. Oh, yeah, we could get it up there. I, I mean, it's a good thing. Otherwise, we just call Matt's best friend's glacier over there and. You should get a discount now that it's for how many times you've used it. I think they were doing like seven hellas, you get one free. <laughs> really? Hey, I was gonna say, are you ready for the ride of your life? Well, the only, the only hard towing part is up this part. Might need a bit of throttle. <laughs> 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 oh my god. Oh, that looks awful. I thought we had it! Uh oh. Oh, oh. oh. Jesus. Failed with my tow job trying to get Lantern up the hill here. So we're gonna try a different towing method where we put a a uh, big stick through his skis and tie it up tight to my bumper. And uh, yeah, we'll see how that works. I feel like this is gonna work well. <laughs> I feel it, like this one's gonna go well. Matt, you got it. Nope. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I thought this was gonna be easy. I'm here. Maybe you should have stayed on it. Let's go. Okay, let's see how far this thing can coast. 
Yeah. I made it to the bottom, so try and beat Let's me. take some bets. We're taking bets, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. I think it can make it right down to the trees. <laughs> Learning tricks from the Swedes. <laughs> If we just drop straight down there, are we below the road? Yeah, we're below the road. Yeah. <laughs> that was good. I enjoyed that. Yeah. Just got to tow through these trees, then we'll send Landon down Death Hill under his own power and then we're at the trail. That should be all right. Oh, no problem. Bye. Cody's gonna tow him the rest of the way. I'm kind of glad I don't have to tow in the trail. Day one in the books, how you feeling? Oh, it was a fantastic day. People, the weather, um, everything I learned, it was amazing. Huh? Glad you had a good time. We got one more day, and I don't know how we're going to talk it, but yeah, I got the full experience, man.